Hey guys, good morning. It is Monday and I just got off of a coaching call with my own business coaches and they are super big on Mondays. They have renamed Monday as Motivational Monday. So I'm just coming to share some of the tips, I guess, that I just learned that I am implementing in my week. So typically we start thinking about Monday as like the end to our weekend, the end to our fun, and most people dread Mondays. In fact, I don't know what the current statistic is, but um, I knew this stat before, but a lot of people have heart attacks and major health um, problems and reasons that they end up in the emergency room most of that happens on a Monday. And um, what I learned a long time ago was that people would dread so much their work week and going to work and the stresses of that week that it would cause them major, major problem on a Monday. So the hospitals were busy. They anticipated your heart attack on that Monday morning because for your body, you literally were like shutting down instead of being excited to start that work week so in my coaching groups what they encourage us to do is not even just like setting your goals and being super pumped and motivated about your monday but also trying to get a lot of what you said you're going to do for the week start it or even complete it on a Monday, right? So you like go into your Monday, I should rename it like Marathon Monday, right? Because the encouragement is for you to try to get as much done as possible. And I think the real reason behind that is when you put some things in motion, when you start a momentum, then it's hard to stop that, right? So if you set some goals out on Monday and you start making the calls and putting everything in place, then as people return your calls or as those things start to play out, you have the rest of the week to deal with it. And you're not starting on Wednesday, placing a call that the person doesn't call you back until the following week. Most things that if you start them on Monday, you're able to complete them during that week so not only am i encouraging you guys to like set your goals for the week and start planning out your week but i'm also going to tell you to be hyper focused on them for your monday so for me it's getting back into my social media routine it is making sure that i'm prepared for this group coaching that i am starting at the end of the month and for me to really get a handle on um, some things that I need to record and, you know, stuff that I have to organize in order to get it done. So on Monday, I'm going to be sitting down writing scripts, recording videos, because then I have to send it for it to be edited and all, you know, all the other things have to happen. And if I don't do that on a Monday or Tuesday by the latest, then it's probably not going to be finished for the week. So I want you guys, if you're watching this, to put in the comments, like, what are your goals for the week? What is the thing that you can do today that's really going to build some momentum for you for the rest of the week? So mine, I just shared, making sure that I'm planning my week and, um, planning out some of those bigger projects that I have to get done and making sure that I really start working on that today and not put it off because then I'll just wait until the next week. By the time you hit Wednesday for anything that you haven't started in your week, you're likely to push that off till the next week. So I'm getting started. I want to hear about what you guys are doing, what your goals are for the week. Um, drop them in the comments. I'm going to share this video. And then also what you could do is if you do drop it in the comments, then you can check later and make sure that you had it done. So one, setting the goal is awesome. Two, writing the goal is even better. But three, sharing it with someone else is usually going to get you closer to about 80% of people who do all three of those, they're going to get their things done. So if you write it in the comment, that's you writing it and sharing it, which is going to increase your chances of 
finishing. So I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys are working on. I'm going to write my goals as well in the comments. And I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great Monday. Let's stop dreading Monday. Let's start attaching some really positive things around it and putting all of our best energy up on a Monday so that we will have a really, really great and productive week. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.